Hello everyone. Welcome back to Redline Diecast Calls. This is part two of the auction red lines that I'm going to be selling on March 22nd on a Facebook site called Studio Dash Redline. Every Tuesday, I run the cars starting at 6 p.m. Central. We have um, a great selection of cars this week. And by the way, I'll be running on the 22nd, the 24th, which is a Thursday, next week Thursday. And I'm also running on Saturday, March 26th, because um, several of the auctioneers on the site are going to be in Charlotte at the Hot Wheels convention. And I'm not going this year, so it gives me an opportunity to chat with you. Yeah, we have some red lines for sale. By the way, I'm always looking to buy red lines as well. This is a custom Continental I picked up a while back in beautiful light blue. Isn't it gorgeous? They didn't paint the tail lights on this one, nor the front blinkers. Yeah, custom Continental. No hood neck either on that one. Also, um, I'll be having a bunch of 68s for sale. 1968s, the original 16, like this Olive Custom Cougar. What a beaut, huh? Olive Custom Cougar. What a gem. You know, <clears throat> just an excellent example of when they originally came out and Mattel first put the lineup together. Man, were they on their game, weren't they? The castings, the beauty of the Spectre Flame translucent paint. Oh, I like this one. Here's number 68. Just love this custom El Dorado in Hong Kong Aqua. Drinking this one, guys. What a beautiful car. Oh my goodness, look at the grill. Look shoes, Hong Kong shoes. Beautiful white interior, black steering wheel. All the edges are clean. Beautiful aqua, custom El Dorado. Gosh, man, I'm telling you what, the, the detail and that they put into these cars, it's amazing they've, they've lasted this long. You know, you figure 1968, 54 years ago. There's another one that's really, really popular, and that is a custom Corvette in light blue. What a gem. Look at that Spectre Flame. Ooh. Ooh, man. Nice grill. Beautiful shoes. Tail lights are still there. Yup, shiny face. What a gem. Yup. Light blue. Awesome car. Custom Corvette. 1968, original 16. Thank you, Harry Bradley. And then speaking of Corvettes, I'm also going to be running some flying colors. And this is an excellent example. This is actually called the Corvette Stingray. The Corvette Stingray. Flying colors. Look at the ribbons on there. Ooh, nice tampos. Nice clean red. Straight through axles, of course. Yeah. A little Corvette action here. Flying colors, Corvette. The cars you see in the back there, I'm, I did in part one. This is part two. Hey, how about a... Um, a uh, fuel heavyweight fueling rig. What do they call this one? I have a piece of paper as a cheat sheet on this one. Fuel tanker. Caught you. <laughs> and then it's got the, the fuel pipes in the back. What a clean white interior. Fuel tanker. Not a crumbler, shiny base, good tail lights, except a little bit missing tail light right there. Not too bad. Nice clean one, guys. The stickers are hard to find clean like that. Are you a heavyweight collector? You like heavyweights? They're fun, aren't they? In fact, they have, um, ah, I'll get that one in a second. Before I do, Before I do, how about a, another 68? 
This one's in orange. Custom Firebird. Nice tail lights on this one too. Orange US Custom Firebird. Little hood deck there. Too bad. Good pins. You see that Pontiac power? There you go. Boom, 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 boom. Who doesn't like the who? <laughs> Here's a moving van in aqua, dark interior. Good tail lights. Super clean. Moving van. It's gonna be a little bit off there, but so what? Drink that baby in. Maybe it'll stay without moving around. Sometimes the cars want to wander. Nice aqua. And then here is something else. Uh, let's see, I'll go in this one next. How about a custom Barracuda in beautiful gold? Look at those shoes. Oh man. And then it's got a little bit of casting slag on the hood and cowl area. That's as far as the hood opens up. Therefore, there's no, there's no nick. Oh, there it goes. I have a jimmy a little bit. Wow, clean, nice, beautiful custom barracuda. Look at the tail light package. Oh man, U.S. gold. What a gem. Someone's gonna enjoy that little gem in their collection. I'll put those heavyweights right there. Well, let me put them on the side. Doesn't take up the, take away from the beauty and the cars in the back there. I don't trust this thing. I think it's gonna wander. Sure enough, as soon as I said it, it wandered away. There you go. <laughs> okay, a couple more. Ooh, 68, I have another 68 here. Check this out, um, the um, racer's edge. <laughs> yeah, the kid put the stickers on there. Isn't that cool? On the back as well. <laughs> a couple little water slides here. Valvoline, Champion. Look how clean that Hong Kong paint is. Oh man, that's a nice blue. Consistent luster of uh, Spectre Flame blue on this custom Camaro. This is a 67 base. Yeah, 67 base. Not painted tail, but oh man, that's clean. Beauty here, guys. A couple of... You know what? I get a couple 68s like that. I just want to show them off. Let's do it. Let's just show off these 68s together. Such a beautiful era of um, Spectre Flame magic coming out of the uh, Mattel factory. How about that? Sure. You with me on that? Mm-hmm. I know you are. Let's make it a trio. Let's make it a trio. What do you think? Let's do another 68. I'll put another 68 up there for your enjoyment. Let's do it. I'm going to push these guys in the back a little bit. Back in there. What's, what's next? What can I put up there that really jazz your brain? How about this? How about a Lime Custom Camaro? Yeah. Beautiful. Ooh, man. Man. A 67 base, too. It is a 67 base. Man. Beauty, beauty here. Let's see, what is this here? Like lime and antifreeze. So here's antifreeze, here's lime. See the difference between the two? The lime, the antifreeze has got like a little yellowish to it, a tinge, whereas the lime is certainly looks like lime, doesn't it? I want to show that difference too. I'll do that in my live auction as well. If you can see the color difference, lime, 368 there. How about it? How about it, gang? Let's give it some love. Wow. Crank that in for a minute. Those are just beautiful. And I have two showstoppers for you to end the uh, to end the tape. It's two showstoppers. They're also going to be flying colors. So you ready? All right, let's take one of these off. I'll take them off here. Beautiful, beautiful, and beautiful. Wow. Okay. <laughs> How about a breakaway bucket? Absolutely gorgeous condition. Look at the tampo there. Super clean, just kept in excellent condition. 
Thank you, collector. I know who you are. Thank you for getting this collection to me. It all worked out. The moon, the star, and the sun all aligned. I got this beautiful collection that came in. All right, tell you what, we're just going to put another. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Two flying colors. What do you think? Last car. Here it is. Heavy Chevy. In beautiful yellow, maroon, and orange. What a beaut. A couple little marks. One, two little marks there. And a little mark on the side here, right? layer on the paint really clean heavy Chevy flying colors era okay let's pan back so I hope you can join us if you do have a question for sale let me know I'm always looking to buy collections the red line era only 1968 through 1977 there is the lineup for March 22nd. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up, share, subscribe, and like the content. And I look forward to seeing you each and every Tuesday. Like I said, this coming week, I'm running Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I'll be running those tapes as well so you can see the variety of cars that we'll have lined up for you. Always uh, great to have you in the house. Even if you don't buy it, I don't care. Just show up, you know, offer your you know, comments about the red line cars. Maybe you know something about a casting. You can share some information. Always good to have you. Like I said, regardless if you buy or not, it's just always good to have people in the house. So until then, hope to see you. Have a great rest of your day. Bye, everybody.